Welcome back to Inktober Tangles. This is day 15 and the tangle is called Abukas and it's by Sharkat who is a CZT. Um, and today's spot is right here, number 15, which is cool because this tangle um, is sort of circular, so that works out well for me. Okay. This is very like flowery, this one. So this is where I will try and control the pen in a way that makes this work. And I'm going to add my petals. I don't know if it matters how many petals you do. I am apparently going to be doing six. So this is, um, she says, Charquette says on her blog that it is like a mixture of Abiko, which is Lynn Mead's Tangle, and the original Zentangle Tangle Arrakis, um, which I mean I can see it's built very similarly to Arrakis, the way you um, continue or aura-ing around things. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to aura around this first circle. And I've said this before um, on my blog and on various other videos is that the, I think that the secret to doing a nice aura is trying to keep the space between your original line and your aura line as consistent as you can. Um, I mean, it's not always possible, but we are human after all. But that's my take on auraing. So now I'm going to start from these points and come down to my aura circle. And I just keep turning the tile. I am um, biggest tangling that I've ever done is on the wall going down my stairs. Um, I have I've tangled the entire one side. I, I might go back and tangle the other side, but I haven't decided yet. It took a long time. The hardest part for me while I was doing that um, was that I couldn't just turn the wall. And so I had ended up like contorting my body into weird shapes so that I could get a good angle for drawing. So, I mean, it really did help me to realize how often I am turning my tiles, which is all the time. Oh, well, I should have done one more here. I guess I will just do it now. Okay, and that one comes down here. Okay, now I do the next aura of the circle. are getting pretty close to each other. But that's all part of it. So I'm sort of running out of space here. 
So I'm just gonna fill it in a little as if I was still going around. as I can. a few people doing this tangle and then using this big circle on the inside to do a zen gem but I I've never done a zen gem I don't know if I would be very good at it this is just me filling in the inside of this circle it's not really part of the tangle I think I may have made it too busy. some contrast. Flux for space filler. I'm pretty sure I've done it in a few places already in here. Oh, not too many. It looks like I've been really relying on the um, orbs as my space fillers. This go around. Well, now it's time for flux. of graphite on here from the 14th so I'm just gonna see if I can just lay it on or do I need to like apply some this might be okay simple. I like it. Okay, thanks for watching. Um, be sure to like this video if you liked it. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and get notifications so you don't miss any. And I will see you guys on the next one. Bye!